Hello Yatris, so now it's time to set up our database with MCP server and now I'm using the Superbase to connect it with cursor. So today we are not going to fire any query to create any table. We are simple give you the prompt and cursor will create automatically all the tables in Superbase using MCP servers. So you don't need to fire any queries, you don't need to give any specific, you know, like query pass out into particular database nothing nothing right so what we are going to do so simply you need to just go to your cursor and cursor setting so as you know from the last couple of my two videos i already set up this things so on github and thipa file so here you need to just go into tools and integration and here it's the super is connected now in your case you need to just click on the new mcp server so click here and you just paste out this code here. I will give you the code in the description. You can check it out there. So here we need to set up our Superbase. So here you need to enter your project ID. Okay, that's it. And secondly, you need to enter the Superbase token key. Now how we are going to catch up these two things. So go to your browser, go to your Superbase and just log in with your email ID. That's it. And create a new project via several simple steps okay now what we are going to do go into the project setting and here you can see the project id nothing you need to just copy this one and paste into project rfe reference fine so here's supervised access token how we are going to get it so go to your profile and just go into your account reference and here you can see the access token so click on the generate new token and just give the name after giving the name, you are able to generate the token key which you need to paste it here. Fine. So I'm going to delete this all the token keys after this video. So no need to access the via my API. Fine. So now how to get this code, right? I will give you the description, but in more details, if you want to set up, what you can gonna do. So new, go to new tab and type Superbase MCP server with cursor. Here you need to just click on the Superbase MCP server and uh, you need to just okay wait I click on the wrong URL go to this one model context protocol Superbase docs here you need to just scroll down and here you can see in the macOS this is my command in the windows you can check it out this one you can just copy this one and paste out that's it now let me go into the cursor and let's test our MCP server so what we are gonna do so let's say uh, Let's say create a one table. Okay. So create a table with the name of Yatri is the table add name contact mm, contact field. Okay. Let's it. And send this. Now let's wait. So here our MCP server is running as you can see the calling apply migration. That means it's going to create a table with particular fields. So click on the run tool. So and just wait. Here you can see the query is fast or it's automatically done by the MCP server. So let me check once into my Superbase. Go to your Superbase. Go into your account. Let's say this is the project. Go into the database and here you can see the Yatri test table is created now. Yatri table is already there but now here you can see this is the table name and content. It's automatically created now. So that is a very pretty much you know the very simple steps you need to just integrate with the cursor and try to use it. So I hope you will be getting something useful and now let's see you got any something error right regarding the API. So what you are gonna do you need to just copy this one export superbase access token key is equals to your api key right into the terminal right and you need to just fire this command npx hyphen by superbase slash mcp server hyphen superbase at the latest right so just paste this command and you are able to solve all the errors in your access this mcp server so yeah i hope you get something really beautiful in your uh development journey so i hope you will be getting something more like in upcoming videos from my side so see you soon subscribe to the Yatri cloud follow me on linkedin 